Today, we'll continue our discussion on the three types of rocks, igneous, sedimentary, and metamorphic. In this video, we'll talk about the sedimentary rocks. Let's get started! Sedimentary rocks. The term implies it is made up of sediments. A sediment is a matter that settles to the bottom of a liquid. Sedimentary rocks are formed from sediments. They make up around 75% of the rocks on the Earth's surface. Okay, there are four types of sedimentary rocks. Clastic, biochemical, organic, and chemical. Clastic sedimentary rocks. The term comes from the word clast. It means a fragment of weathered rock. Rocks are composed of fragments or clasts of pre-existing minerals and rock. Alright, the classic sedimentary rocks follow Wed CC formation. W E D C C W stands for weathering, E for erosion, D for deposition, C compaction, and the last T cementation. Weathering. It is actually the breaking down of rocks. In the image shown here, the rock is broken down into smaller chunks or smaller pieces. That's it about weathering. Okay, in erosion, clasts or pieces of rocks are transported by wind, water, and even gravity to other location. In the example here, you can see the soil that is eroded. So it is transported from one spot to another location. That's it for erosion. After erosion, deposition follows. Here, particles are deposited as new sediment. This sometimes occur in the body of water. So you can see here, actually, there are three processes shown in the image. Weathering, the breaking down of rocks. After the, the rocks are broken down, it is eroded, meaning it is transported to other location. And then after that, it is deposited to the bottom of water. So that's it for the deposition. Okay, the next is compaction. You can see the two images. Layers of deposition build on top of one another and begin to squeeze closer together. Uh, in the image labeled before, you can see the, the, the arrangement of rocks. They're farther from each other. And in the image labeled after, you can see the rocks are already compacted. So that's it for the compaction. Okay, now the cementation. Eventually, Minerals and water act like glue and cement all the pieces together. The end result is a sedimentary rock. This process of loose sediment hardening into rock by cementation and compaction collectively is called lithification. Alright, the next type of Sedimentary rock is called biochemical sedimentary rock. It is made up of shells which are cemented together. So in the image here, it shows coquina. It is a type of sedimentary rock that is basically made up of shells. That's it for the biochemical sedimentary. <laughs> The next type is organic sedimentary rocks. These rocks are formed from organic matter including plants and animals which then altered underground. There are four examples here. Peat, it is a brown deposit resembling soil formed by its partial decomposition of vegetable matter. Then the lignite. 
it is naturally compressed peat, the lowest rank of coal, anthracite, coal of hard variety, uh, bituminous coal. It is coal having a high volatile content, burns with a bright smoky flame. Alright, the last type is chemical sedimentary. These are the rocks that crystallize and precipitate directly from water. There are two examples given here, the gypsum and the rock salt. So that's it for the sedimentary rocks. Thanks for watching.